comparisons can be exhausting. All right, I think Techie's gotta settle down. The claim from some reviewers, the OnePlus 9 camera is crippled because it does not have optical image stabilization. I feel that should be a really easy claim to demonstrate versus a similarly priced phone. That's not a subtle criticism. Crippled is a really strong word to use. So we should be able to examine that. OIS is mostly beneficial for reducing handshake in still photos, and the easiest way to see that is in low light conditions. I've got some really dark nighttime samples from the Galaxy S21, which has a smaller traditional RGB sensor with OIS. And I've got some similar samples from the OnePlus 9, which uses a larger quad Bayer sensor, but lacks hardware stabilization. Now, to be totally fair, I did shoot these samples on different nights, but I work pretty hard to match the field of view and the lighting conditions. That's the thing about really reviewing cameras. You don't just share random shots without context. You try to test consistently so you know what you're looking for. A few of these angles will not be exact, but I still think we can use these shots to gauge comparative performance. So let's play. The claim is not that the two phones are close, but that the OnePlus 9 is crippled. Even if the samples aren't perfectly matched angle for angle, shot for shot, we should be able to see if one phone is crippled. Here's the game I like to play. Instead of labeling the phones and guiding you to the conclusion that I want you to have, you're going to see a phone A and a phone B. Now, phone A and phone B are not the same in every test setup. I'm going to swap them around because again, crippled should be easy to spot. We'll run through the tests in this video here. You drop a comment down below telling me which phone you thought was which, and I'll announce the results on next week's Monday morning podcast. You got all that? Are you ready? Here we go. All right, did you write out which phone you thought took each shot? Drop those comments down below. Techies are putting the OnePlus 9 camera at crippled, so we should be able to easily verify crippled. That said, I was kind of proud of me for getting so close to matching the composition of my test shots from memory. The one that I definitely missed, the one I didn't line up as well as I thought I could have was the lock, but I still felt it was worth including just for another ultra low light comparison. And I look forward to your comments. As always, thanks so much for watching, for sharing these videos. The sharing part is really important these days and subscribing to the channel. And I'll catch you all on the next video.